Hi guys, I'm here with April's Ipsy bag. Also sorry if there's any background noise of someone cutting the grass because someone is cutting the grass. But I just got April's Ipsy bag in the mail and I'm gonna go ahead and do a little reveal for you guys. Um, if you would like to see my past Ipsy videos, go ahead and check out the description box. I'll have the links below and some other fun stuff in there for you guys. Be sure to subscribe and follow me on my social media as well. Okay, so they come in these pink bags. So, April's bag is super cute. It's like this cute little lemon bag. I assume that it's supposed to be like spring inspired. So let's see what's inside. Okay. So I have the card and yep, it says fresh spring beauty. And it has everything in here. So first thing is tart base tape which is a primer. It says Tarte Double Duty Beauty Base Tape Hydrating Primer. This brand new primer is loaded with jojoba and grapeseed extract to moisturize and keep your skin hydrated for 12 full hours and coconut to smooth your skin. Plus it helps your makeup look better and last longer. And like all of Tarte's fab formulas, this one is vegan and cruelty free. So that's nice. It's a little face primer. Next we have this face cleanser. And this is by the brand Mapalim Face Cleanser. With roots in Tel Aviv, Israel, Mapalim, probably not saying this right, draws from the location's vibrant lush lifestyle, enriched, ugh, enriched with rosemary, jojoba, and argan oil, this gentle cleanser soothes, tones, and revitalizes your skin. Plus, the jasmine and cedarwood scent is refreshing, not overbearing. Okay, so that's nice. Then in here, oh, it came out of the package. This was the package. Um, and this is the little, this is super cute, front and back. It's Laura Sanchez Moods Eyeshadow in Chocolate Shake. So it just looks like this, it's a matte brown eyeshadow. And it says, this Colombian makeup artist was Nick's Faces, or NYX, I don't know if it's Nick's or NYX, 2016 Beauty Vlogger of the Year, and her brand is all about bold color and self-expression. This highly pigmented matte finish, red brownish eyeshadow is ultra creamy and blends easily to set your creative urges free. So it's matte, and it's a reddish brown, so. That's cute. Then, I've really been needing this because I always seem to lose mine. It is an Ico Black Magic Liquid Eyeliner. And it says, <clears throat> Ico Black Magic Liquid Eyeliner Travel Size in the color Carbon Black. Looking for a new liner to love? Ico and their A-plus waterproof liner dries ASAP and won't fight the and won't fade, smudge, or budge, so no worries about having to reapply. With its tapered precision, precision tip, the looks you can create with it are limitless. Go thin with your flick or lay it on thick. So let's see what the brush looks like. Ooh, so it's a nice, thin brush, just how I like it. I usually use like the, if you've ever used like the Wet n Wild liquid eyeliner, it's like a brush, rather than like kind of like the marker kind. But this one looks nice and thin. Oh, it is kind of like a brush tip, which is good. I never use liquid eyeliner uh, eyeliner anymore, but I've been wanting to use it and haven't had any because I like don't use it like I used to. I used to wear winged eyeliner every single day, like no joke. And I think that was, oh, there's one more thing. And it's in here. Be careful because sometimes there's stuff in here that won't fit in the bag. And it is an eyeshadow brush. And it's very soft. It looks like this. I love when I get brushes. Um, it's Visanti Contour Eyeshadow Brush. Super cute. Let's see what it says. Visanti Cosmetics Contour Eyeshadow Blended Out Brush. Visanti Cosmetics was founded by four sisters who are passionate about inclusive beauty products. The synthetic... 
The synthetic fiber tapered brush head is great for shaping defining the eye contour. Plus the soft bristles blend out powders like a dream. And that is everything that I got. As always, I will link everything that I got, if I can find it, in the description. Oops in the description box below so be sure to check that out and thumbs this video up if you would like to see May's ipsy bag as well.